Uh, state police are considering filing charges after two pit bulls attacked a 12-year-old girl in Lebanon over the weekend. The dogs belong to the girl's family. Police say the dogs got out of their pen and then attacked Angel Sargent, her younger sister, and a friend. A man who heard Angel screaming helped to get the dogs off of her. Angel suffered bites on her legs and her shoulders, and the man was also bitten. The two other girls suffered bruises and cuts. And in light of this incident and other involving a child in Farmingdale recently, WMTW News H Jim Keithley spoke with two certified dog trainers about what dog owners can do to keep their families safe. Let's go, girl. At this expansive dog training facility in Falmouth, certified trainers hold classes for people who have dogs that need a lesson in obedience. One of the classes is actually called Feisty Fido. Any breed can be aggressive. Any dog can bite. A lot of times it's frustration. It's frustration combined with stress, and the dog gets over threshold and will react. In Lebanon over the weekend, it was two pit bulls that repeatedly bit a 12-year-old girl. The officer on the scene of that incident says many things can contribute to an animal getting out of control. He says in general, pet owners should be responsible. I haven't fully vaccinated, up to date on shots, vet visits, things like that, um, properly nourished, things like that. Um, just general rules for owning a pet. Back at the training center, Judy Moore shows us exactly what happens when a stranger approaches this little dog. So you see him close his mouth and leaning away? Do you see the difference in the behavior? Look at the dog staring at him. Those are signs that the dog is worried. Good girl. I didn't think you'd do that. KT O'Shea, another certified trainer, says even dog owners may not realize or recognize the early signs of aggression in their own pets. Knowing the signs, she says, can make a big difference, especially when small children are around. So a lowered head or a lick of the lips um, could be a sign, too, that they're fearful. Not necessarily aggressive, but they are fearful. Fear can turn into some form of aggression, whether it be barking, nipping, biting. Here at the Obedience School, dogs like Sylvia, a German Shepherd, learn how not to be fearful. This particular training session sealed with a kiss. In Falmouth, Jim Keithley, WMTW News 8.